back live here on Overdrive. And you can see El Diablo come down to the ring. And let me just say this, that freaking son of a bitch has been attacking CJ Hawkins for the past few shows, you know? I mean, what is this beef with CJ Hawkins? Like, what the hell, Diablo? Planet it! The CJ Hawkins! Now he's getting his revenge on El Diablo with a freaking chair! And now El Diablo's got the chair on CJ Hawkins with CJ takes the chair and oh, nails El Diablo with the chair! CJ a little exhausted from getting annihilated earlier, but I think CJ's gonna pay for this. And another clothesline by El Diablo. And CJ Hawkins with a takedown on El Diablo! Man, these two really hate each other's guts. For some odd reason, El Diablo really hates CJ Hawkins. But I think CJ is paying for it. He's going to have more punishment onto CJ on to himself, thanks to El Diablo. Oh, CJ tried to fight back, but I don't think he can because he's freaking exhausted from getting annihilated earlier. Man, this freaking sucks, yo. Can't believe this. Uh oh. Oh, slams DJ right on his back. Onto the mat. CJ trying to fight back. Doing the best he can to fight back. Choking El Diablo. I like that. But El Diablo is still powering up. Punches to the face, but CJ blocks one. Nice whip to the post. And rams his face right on the post. And CJ Hawkins doing the best he can to fight back. He wants revenge on El Diablo. Oh, now he's got a steel chair. Look at this. Oh! Nails El Diablo with the chair. Oh, Rams is annihilates that shot. Really nailed him with that shot. And now picking him up. He was in a Van Daminator by CJ Hawkins. This is not even a match. And now picking up El Diablo. And now throws him to the ring. Out of the ring to the floor. Stomping on El Diablo, kicking him to the stomach. And uh oh. Oh, rams his face right on the coat. And CJ Hawkins is making sure he gets his revenge. Oh, man. CJ Hawkins really beating the hell out of El Diablo. Uh oh. Oh, I need to the face by CJ Hawkins. I think CJ Hawkins has finally had enough of El Diablo. And now throws him to the outside. And now he's got the steel steps. CJ is daring El Diablo to get up, get up. Now CJ with a freaking picks up El Diablo. Oh, what a suplex! Uh oh, and now, oh man, take it down the commentary desk. Wow, Diablo back up and oh nails him right in the face with the steel step. Now pick it up El Diablo. Throws it right on the freaking commentary desk. Uh oh. Oh! He's going for the pedigree on El Diablo and oh right through the table. Looks like it's official that he wants to 
fight on that vendetta and look at this! Show the disrespect to El Diablo. Tell him to suck it. That's right. The freaking Deadly Alliance could suck it. Oh, Diablo's back up. Oh! Nice choking the hell out of El Diablo. E.J. Hawkins. It finally had enough of El Diablo. Uh oh. Oh man! Nails El Diablo with the steel step. And now, uh oh. And a pedigree right on the concrete floor. Man, oh man. I believe CJ Hawkins has finally had enough of El Diablo. And they're going to have to settle their differences once and for all at Vendetta. And will CJ Hawkins go on top against El Diablo? Well, folks, coming up next. It will be our six-man tag team main event. It will be Jack Fox, Frankfurt, and Ash Raven to team up against Cody Hawkins, Old Wax, and Al Solson. It's going to be live, and it's coming up next. Right, here we go, folks. The main event of BYU Overdrive. Here comes Cypher and Jack Fox of the Deadly Alliance. What a show event that is going to be. Of course, Jack Fox will be set to take on Alex Olsen for the North American Championship, and I'm not really sure who Cypher is going to wrestle. I mean, Cypher was in the first ever event at 2007. He, he, he was the World Heavyweight Champion three years ago. Around that time, and he defended the World Heavyweight title against Vincent. That was a really good match. It was an amazing main event back then in 2007. Here comes the tag team partner, Ash Raven, the former European champion. Better stop trying You know that there's no denying I won't show mercy yeah, folks. on you I think Vendetta is going to be safe to be awesome We're trying to find out, you know, also at Vendetta What will the face of you? The face of you while you older guys will change forever I mean, what the hell is going to happen? I don't know There's of course, you know, the speculation and the rumor of, you know, Nathan L. not being the ex-GM of Overdrive. Meaning, I guess, uh, somebody else is going to be taking control of Overdrive, I guess. That's what it sounds like to me from movie. It really does. What the who? You know? And here comes Alex Olsen. Who will be set to team up with AWACS and Cody Hawkins. This should be an interesting matchup. The six man tag team made event. I'll take a handful if you please. Yo, everyone loves them from Anima Turtles from outer space. Can't get enough of them. You know something else I really hate? Jack Fox, you know. Of course there's some fans that like Jack Fox, whatever. But I hate his guts. He is a no good, arrogant son of a bitch. He is an arrogant bastard, Jack Fox. Jack Fox is epic. No, he's not epic. He's a he's a no good bastard. But not this guy, AWAX. AWAX is freaking awesome as hell, this guy. And yes, I still like his music. So don't freaking judge me. Shut up, assholes. But this guy is a big ass dude. He looks like he's in tremendous shape, you know? Cut my life into pieces. And here this comes CJ Hawkins' his younger brother, the former light heavyweight champion, Cody Hawkins. 